Oscar Bevis for IFL TV in association with MTK Global here at the MS Bank Arena in Liverpool. Just seen Callum Smith versus John Ryder. Just spoken to Joe Gallagher. Yeah. And he said also in the press conference that he's disappointed with the negativity around Callum. He's the first man to defend the Ring magazine, but in 11 years in the UK. Yeah. And a lot of people are talking about uh, the scorecards, you thought? Yeah. Um, the scorecards, did I think there was a bit wide? Yeah, I, um, I, thought, I thought Callum Smith won the fight, but. Um, I thought it was close to the scorecard said. I, I think I had Callum by two. Um, but he, listen, it was a close fight. John Ryder gave a brilliant account of himself when very few people gave him a chance. Callum wasn't at his best, but then how much of that was down to John Ryder fighting a good fight, I'm not sure. Um, but I think what happens is, do you know, people run with something and then they just, they do like, you see, I see social media like claiming a robbery, which is mental, do you know, um, in, in my opinion. But like I said, I thought, I thought John Ryder, um, was brilliant tonight. Um, Callum wasn't at his best, whether that was down to the tactics of John Ryder, which which paid off, I don't know. But um, like I said, I think the right man won. And he's disappointed also, Callum and Joe, with people talking about a rematch? Yeah, yeah, well, I don't... Do you understand that? I understand people talking about it because it was a close fight, but it's not like, obviously, Callum wants the big fights, the big nights. He's still there. And he's... Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm coming over now. He's... Um, Sorry, where was I? Yeah, Callum. So, I think that the big nights, the big nights, what he wants, your Anfield nights, your unification nights and stuff like that, it's, it's not going to be in Callum's interest for, you know, for, to have that rematch. It's, um, so, no, yeah, I don't, I can understand the frustration in, you know, people saying about a rematch. And now for Callum, are people going to be looking at this and licking their lips and people in the top possibly, of the super middleweight possibly division? Possibly, you might, but styles make fights. Like, people will go. There'll be people, I know for a fact, I've not looked online going, how can you call Canelo's name out? Um, well, notoriously, Billy Joe Saunders has been one person we've always said. And Fury, for example, yeah. that and the higher it, fight, but, level fight, and a higher... But Callum, Callum will raise his game and styles make fights. <laughs> He's a killing me, by the way. <laughs> Sorry. Get Come on, it. we're trying to be professional here. <laughs> um, yeah, so you feel like, obviously, the big guys will be looking at that yeah. fight and thinking I, uh, Callum's there for the taking? Think, or? Yeah, well, possibly. Possibly will, but then, like I say, Styles mate fights and Callum, Nicky, after Nicky Olskin, very few people was giving Callum a chance of beating George Groves. So, like I say, Styles mate fights, but yeah, it might, might end up being a blessing where the big names fancy it with Callum now. But, you know, Callum's got the marbles at the main ones at um, super middleweight, so hopefully the, the big fights are going to happen for him. The big fight is obviously Canelo, that's the biggest, because yeah. you would call him the biggest name in boxing. Yeah. But Billy Joe Saunders. Billy I mean, Joe Saunders, that's, that's a big fight, I mean. And people have said that he hasn't, didn't perform as well as yeah, he could have Billy, Billy a couple Joe's of weeks ago, so let's Sean stick him in together. The time. There's, there's that, there's, there's Triple G, there's Daniel Jacobs, there's Chris Eubank Jr. There's all kind of big fights, you know, to be made. Um, but and that's what I mean now. I, I believe it will happen. John was mandatory, and you know we don't the shot as if it's mandatory. Um, but yeah, Callum. Listen, the main thing is he's kept his belt. He wasn't at his best, but he come through it, and um, the big fights are still there. All right, Anthony. Thank you for giving me some of your time. No and, worries, um, man. Thanks for having us. Sorry for getting interrupted. <laughs>